Hello, Cancers, and welcome back to my channel, Luma Moon Tarot. Oh boy, Cancer. <laughs> Cancer, somebody's got the hots for you, man. I'm telling you. Ooh, yeah, and you're, you've got some uh, spiritual team, uh, some ancestor who is protecting you here. Yeah. Anyway, Cancer, I love you guys. Um, the, I'm here to do your daily reading, my darlings. This reading is for the collective, so it may not resonate with all of you, okay? Just take what, what does resonate, Cancer, and leave the rest, right? Don't try to force it. And I love you, Cancer, so, so much. Thank you all so much for all of your support. Um, I love all of my subscribers. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, everyone who's new here, thank you so much. Um, just thank you, Cancer. I, I hope you guys are having a good week so far. Um, so anyway, Cancer, this is somebody too that you could work with here. Um, somebody's really got the hots for you. <laughs> oh, man. They think that you're extremely sexy. This could even be someplace... Um, like they're watching you at work, um, something like that. For those of you who are online, maybe somebody's watching you do your work and they find you, wow, ooh, cancer. This person is like really hot. Okay, let me tell you about this card. Um, uh, years ago, in my 20s, right, I had this boyfriend. And um, oh my gosh, I was coming home from work one day and he lived actually in the apartment um, underneath me, right? I lived right above him. And um, <laughs> I pull into my parking spot and he comes strutting out like he had this swagger about him that was just like so hot. He had on these torn jeans and this button up shirt, but it wasn't buttoned up. It was like loose and open you know and he had these abs and oh and then he did this lean thing this really sexy lean as he looked at me parking my car with this beautiful smile he was absolutely stunningly beautiful i had to sit in the in the in my parking space for just a few minutes like a while and watch him right a few minutes at least and um yeah, because it was just stunningly. Okay, so you're both sexy. Somebody very good looking is watching you, Cancer. I, For some reason, I get the feeling like it's a secret admirer or somebody new. Um, this could be somebody who does a lot of work with their hands, okay? Um, construction worker, builder, something like that. I don't know, man. Wherever you are, they're watching you. Um, this person's going to approach you like they need something from you, okay? It's just a first approach. But I feel like, yeah, with the PSD, or PTSD, you're going to be really nervous by that approach, okay? Because I feel like um, you guys haven't been around anybody for a while, this is going to kind of, it's going to make you feel a bit awkward. You, it's going to, like, shock you. Um, they're going to approach you and ask you for some kind of help or ask you for something. I feel like this person may, may work at your place of work or they're watching you work, something like that. Um, but holy cow, they are really good looking, Cancer. <laughs> okay. Like, they're really good looking, and they've got, man, if if somebody approaches you at work and they, like, do a lean, and you're like, hubba, please leave a comment, you guys. This is such a fun little reading. Um, please leave a comment. It's going to make you really nervous. You're not going to know how to react, because I feel like you've been in isolation for a while here, Cancer. <laughs> you're going to be like, where am I right now? <laughs> I love you. Oh my gosh, this is cute. <clears throat> yeah, I feel like you have a secret admirer and somebody, they think you're sexy. You're going to think that they're just, you know, beautiful. Um, take it how it resonates with you, but I feel like you've got a secret admirer here. And they're about to make an approach, okay? <laughs> they're going to ask you for something weird, like, and you're going to be sitting there like, uh... Ah, uh, <laughs> you're not going to know how to answer the question. Um, yeah, and it's going to come, it's going to happen out of the blue, 
out of the blue cancer you are not going to be expecting this at all <laughs> oh I love this reading for you you guys I love this reading I will never forget the moment he walked out of those doors and leaned up again oh my goodness I was in the car going oh that's my boyfriend that's my boyfriend <laughs> you know yeah just a beautiful person um yeah oh my gosh on the bottom of the deck cancer we got the king of wands holy cow holy cow cancer this is somebody very good looking okay very good looking um yeah man and they take action this is what i'm talking about they take action yeah this is they're gonna flirt with you cancer i feel like this is someone new this is someone new they've been hiding how they feel about you i really get the feeling like this is somebody new options right all around this person could have lots of other options but you're the one that they want okay she really turns my crank okay seriously <laughs> Oh my gosh, yeah. Cancer. I'm sorry, it's just so cute. This person, I feel like they've been secretly, like they've been holding back, holding back, holding back, approaching you. I get the feeling like the, even though this person is really good looking and they will take a step forward, like when they have to muster that courage, Cancer, they do it um they will they're going to but yet there's something very shy about this person okay you could be dealing with the water sign cancer scorpio pisces or they may have it in their chart and be very sensitive um like they, they've got a shy side about them which is makes it even better i don't know um yeah i feel like this is a secret admirer cancer i gotta say <sighs> Yeah, they've been, they've been keeping the, I feel like they've been watching you for some time here, okay? And they're ready to turn the page. Let's get on it. Like, that's kind of the feeling that I'm thinking here. They're ready to, to start a new chapter. They're ready to turn the page and get something going. And so, yeah, but whatever they're approaching you with, like, they're going to ask you for something or... A piece of equipment or a tool or something like that and you're gonna be like what what are you talking about what yeah that's you what what do you mean <laughs> Empress energy you could be a boss you could be a business owner they could be coming to your business for I don't know deliveries or something like that who knows I feel like this person knows you from work or if you work online, they they have been watching you, okay? Um, yeah, and I feel like when they approach you and ask you um, for, for whatever this is that they're going to ask you for, you're going to be like, I don't really know what you, I don't know, what are you talking about? But you know what, you're going to feel off this person that this is a, you're going to be, you're going to be, you may even be crushing on them too, Cancer. Like, this is somebody I feel like that you want, and you're going to be looking so good that day in your empress outfit. <sighs> yeah, Cancer, but you're not going to know what it is that they're, like, how, what do I say? How do I help them? I don't know what, what do you want? Which tool? <laughs> what is it that you wanted again? I'm sorry. <laughs> Because you're still going to be thinking about, holy cow, I really like this person. Yeah, this is somebody who's been watching you from afar. They've been watching, holy cow, Cancer, they've been watching you glow. They've been watching you. They find you extremely attractive. I feel like this person has daydreams about you, you know, like what you look like, you know, what... <laughs> yeah anyway cancer yeah this person's coming towards you they've been watching you for a while now i feel that they're about to shoot their shot cancer i'm telling you here it comes <laughs> yep it's like judgment day for this person are you gonna do it are you not gonna do it right 
Um, yeah, they're about to communicate with you, Cancer. Whoever this is, you have a secret admirer, and they are absolutely beautiful. Oh my gosh, they're gorgeous, Cancer. This, And I feel like you already like this person. Maybe you're both really shy. You know what I mean? Maybe you both have some PTSD from past relationships. That's just carrying over some pains and things that bother you from the past you know bad memories that kind of thing right nervousness right um maybe a bit like not able to trust that kind of thing i if you might have, both have this but you're per this person this is a new person mind you this isn't someone from your past this is someone new that wants to get to know you, that has the total hots for you, Cancer. And I feel like you like them too. You like them too, man. <clears throat> it's the moment of truth, Cancer. I feel like this person's going to come and talk to you. They have to. They have to. You know, I feel like you may even be asked out. I got to say, they may even ask you out here with the um, page of wands out here. Yeah, man, they <laughs> they want to ask you out. And I feel like if they do, you're going to say yes. Oh, yes. Oh, as a matter of fact, of course I'll go out with you. Uh, somebody's going to want to sabotage this, though. So it, it, do not say anything about this, Cancer. Okay, don't say anything about this. I feel like somebody wants to sabotage this or will want to sabotage it. So keep your moves hidden. Don't post anything about it, nothing. I feel like somebody here has been watching you too, keeping their back turned, maybe waiting for some kind of piece of information to, I don't know. Um, they want to sabotage anybody who comes in to try to swoop you up because they want you. So please be careful because this new connection is really cute. And, and I hope that you guys leave a comment, please. Um, please drop a comment if this is about you. Yeah, see, someone else is watching you close as well. And they know they're about to miss out on an opportunity here. They're already feeling really pouty and um, kicking rocks, you know? Kicking rocks. Yeah, they may want to communicate with you. I feel like, I feel like things are going to start moving for you really fast now. You're about to meet someone new and whole... Oh, I'm telling you, you're going to be like, wow. <laughs> yeah, I feel like, and both of you are so cute here together. I have to say it, Cancer. You're so cute because you're both kind of shy. You're both like afraid of showing your emotions right now. You know what I mean? <clears throat> I just get that feeling, but oh, this person. Yeah, I feel like when your past person sees this, because some of you, some of you are going to put it online or post something about it. Okay, when your past person sees this, they're going to know it's over. Oh, they're going to know it's over. There's going to be really nothing they can do. I feel. Yeah, you're moving forward. You're moving on. I feel like someone else is coming to take you to calmer waters. That's really what I'm feeling like there, Cancer. Someone else is coming in. That's that song, guys. Um, um, yeah, because I worship the woman you walked on. That's that's the name of the song. I worship the woman you walked on. They're coming in to right all this person's wrongs. That's what they're going to do. And I feel like both of you together are going to get yourselves to calmer waters. This is someone new. I feel like for a lot of you, you're they're going to ask you out and you're going to accept. You're going to do it. You know, you are. You're going to take that leap of faith, Cancer, and, and this person is too. Believe me, they're going, to be, um, they're going to be talking to you first, right? They're going to make the first approach here. Um, and your person from your past, I feel like they find out about it somehow, and I feel like it's something you're putting out there online. Somebody tells them or they see it somehow, and man, they get, they're really upset. Because they know that you're moving on now, and they know it's about to be over. Yeah, well, it, it really already is. If you're moving forward, if you're in this chariot, 
you've already disconnected, okay? And you're having a victory here because this new person is going to blow your mind, I'm telling you. Oh, Cancer. I love this reading for you, you guys. Um, I am going to take this over into the extended because I, you know, I'm going to leave your date alone, right? Let you two share some time together alone because I really don't feel any red, I don't see or feel any red flags off this new person. Not a one. Not one. As a matter of fact, I see you both um, feeling the same way about each other. Okay? And getting to know each other slowly with a date. A date. Okay? Um, but I want to dig into this person from your past. Like, they already have plans to try to sabotage new connections. So I want to look deeper into that and see what their real plans are here for this. Because... This is just too cute to pass up here, Cancer. <laughs> okay. Anyway, um, I love you, Cancer. I do hope this helps. I hope it resonates with you. If you guys are interested in the extended, there's a link to follow at the bottom of my description box that'll take you straight to Patreon. Just choose the messenger tier, right? And um, yeah, Cancer, if you like this, hit that like button, um, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and you like this vibe. And um, st remember, um, don't forget about the giveaway, guys. I'm going to include a little snippet at the end of the video for you with all of the, de of the decks lined out, right? So anyway, I, I love you, Cancer. This is fabulous. Um, I hope this, this resonates. Drop a comment, you guys, please. Let me know. Let me know um, if this happens for you because it's so adorable. Anyway, I love you. Take care of you, my darlings, and peace out. Hello, everyone. Um, I'm popping in at the end of the videos to remind you guys that there is going to be a Christmas holiday giveaway. Yay! Um, these are the fabulous, wonderful decks that I'm giving away to six lucky winners here on December 24th. The names of the winners are going to be announced on December 24th, you know. Um, so, yeah, um, we've got the Pulp Tarot, the Astro Matrix, the Mystic Martians Oracle, the Garbage Pail Kids Tarot, the After Tarot, and as a bonus deck, um, I included the Cat Tarot because it was so dang popular last year. Okay, so um, yeah, all you have to do, you know, show your support, right? Um, you can click the like button, subscribe to the channel, and then um, comment in the in the comment section below um, the deck the name of the deck you would like to try to win for the holiday giveaway okay um, yeah and then I'm going to announce the winners on December 24th okay um, yeah this is to show my appreciation to everybody because you're always so cool and awesome to me out here you really are you really truly are I I don't get this kind of support like you know in my life, you guys have shown me the most support out of everyone in my life, and I'm just so grateful for all of you. Um, so yeah, I'm at the giveaway I'm super excited about because I'm giving away some of my favorite decks here, you know. Um, th these are the decks that I use in my own readings. They're all brand new in packaging, but these are copies, right, of my favorites. So yeah, just pick the deck that you would like, type it in the comment section, and you'll be entered to win in the drawing on December 24th, okay? Um, anyway, everyone, just know that you are loved. I love you and appreciate you. And until next time, take care of you and peace out.